Hello, I'm Marcus at Mini Mammoth Films. Uh, this is a review video of some test footage that I got of the DJI Osmo, which was something we'd recently purchased. I took it with me to Bangkok whilst I was on my holiday, and as you can see, you can get some really nice footage. The stabilization is fantastic, which of course you would expect from a three axis gimbal, but for the price, you get a lot of power for your pound. The camera isn't perfect and you do need to make sure you've got an ND filter when shooting outside. Unfortunately, I only took an ND4 with me and a variable ND would be more than enough for an ND filter set. But as you can see, I haven't spent massive amount of time in um, color grading this in post, but if you do get on a vehicle or, you know, this is a pedal boat, you can get some really nice additional dynamics to it and some great footage. My camera works not great here, but it does give you an idea of what can be got. I am very impressed with the stabilization. Can't say much more than that. This is some night footage, you know, it's not great in low light, but you can get some decent footage if you do get the right settings. This is literally me holding the camera for a couple of minutes, so the stabilization is very good to get us time lapse, even handheld. I did the same here with the Mahanakon Cube, a beautiful building in Bangkok. This isn't really usable though, because of course the trees moving, that doesn't really look very good, but it was just to get an indication of how, how good a time lapse you can get handheld. There is a little bit of movement in there, but if you stabilized in post, it would be pretty much nigh on perfect, I think. So all in all, really impressed with the stabilization of this camera first out the, out the bag. We will be shooting a lot more, so we'll find out a little bit more further down the line. I will be releasing more videos about the camera itself, which does need more of a review, but do stay tuned. Ashley and I will be releasing lots of review videos of all sorts of little bits of kit and accessories that we've got that we use to make our films. Speaking of which, I have included a couple of our films here. Do have a watch, and if you like what you see, subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys. The worst was Flounder. He said I was a selfish c which I suppose I am.